roams the hills of Scotland. And in fact, it, it appears, due to our uh, somewhat murky view of history, we don't know the exact story, but it appears that the haggis is a beast that essentially constituted itself from the aforementioned slain bodies of the clan wars. <laughs> well, that's a little scary. <laughs> but wait, but wait. In the process, bringing the best of all the corners of Scotland into one delicious and juicy <laughs> being. And this haggis is now, um, it's now only attainable in, uh, in, in very rare locations. Of course, for those of us in Scotland, we grow up in the midst of plenty. And so we can find haggis in pretty much any butcher shop. But if you live in the United States of America, it's not that easy. In fact, uh, haggis, I have heard, is outlawed by federal regulations in the United States of America. Apparently, because the government is afraid that if everyone got a taste of the honey, <laughs> they would very soon start emigrating over to Scotland. <laughs> so, you know, we're, uh, we're very cautious about, uh, about haggis in this country. But